Hey guys, this is Shirish and you are on Bonsai and Gardening Zone. And in today's DIY workshop, I am going to demonstrate how to make a beautiful self-watering 3D tri tower for strawberry plants from PVC pipes. Also how to take proper care of strawberry plants and get lots of strawberries from that. I'll also share two months step by step updates from planting saplings to harvesting ripe berries. All that is coming up. Guys, it's very easy, quick and inexpensive to make a 3D strawberry tower like this. A vertical planting technique like this should be a great idea, especially when you lack a garden space. Guys, you need 6 things for this DIY idea. Number 1. A PVC pipe which should be at least 9 feet long with a diameter of 4 inch or above. Number 2. 3 number of flat PVC pipe end caps or scrap plastic containers like this 1 kg paint bucket to make base of the tower. Number 3. 6 number of nut bolts. Number 4. A glass bottle or a small steel tumbler. Number 5. Angle cutter or funnel blade saw. And number 6. A drill machine or some pointed object to make holes. So guys, let's begin our DIY project. First of all, mark the pipe on every 3 feet and cut the pipe in 3 equal pieces, 36 inch each. Now take this 1 kg empty paint bucket and cut it 2 inch above from the bottom. You can also use flat PVC pipe end caps like this instead. File the rough edges. Make some drainage holes at the bottom. Now make two marks on this pipe, 4 inch each with the distance of 12 inches. Then cut through the mark. Now heat around the cut area on flame carefully. Keep on checking for softness but do not overheat or it will melt. Expand the cut with tumbler or glass bottle while it is hot. Next, we need to join these three pipes with each other. Now on the opposite side of the holes, make a mark on 3 inch on top and bottom in a line. Repeat the same in one more pipe. Now drill the holes. Join both pipes with nut bolts. Now as you can see these two pipes has been joined with each other. Now we need to connect third pipe. Place third pipe in the center of two pipes and mark the touching point of third pipe with other two pipes. Make the holes and fix the bolts. Fix the bottom caps. Now our tower is ready for planting. To grow strawberries in tower, 
we need fluffy, well-drained and nutrient-rich organic soil. To make best soil mix, we need garden soil 30%, vermicompost 30%, coco peat or peat moss 30%, perlite or sand 10%. Mix it all very well. Now I'll fill this soil mix into the towers. Before filling soil, fill 1 inch gravels at the bottom to ensure proper drainage. Now fill the soil mix to the level of first hole. We will now plant strawberry saplings. Take the plant out of plastic bag and remove soil around the roots ball carefully. Make sure not to damage feeder roots. Now insert roots of saplings into the hole. Always keep the crown above the soil or your plant will rot. Now apply some coco coir or moss grass around the holes to avoid drainage of soil from holes. Now one by one I'll plant all 9 saplings into the holes. So now my vertical strawberry tower is ready. Now I'll water it throughout until water starts to drain. Remember, vertical planting like this needs careful watering as upper part dries out soon. If you let the soil completely dry out, your plant may die. So frequent watering is required. Keep it in shade for around a week, then place it on the spot which remains sunny all the time. Along with 3D tower, I am also planting some saplings of Archer strawberry variety in big clay pots and plastic containers. This variety produces huge big size strawberries. Guys, it's been 20 days since transplanting and flowering has been started in the tower plants as well as potted plants. Guys, after 40 days, Plants are filled with green small strawberries and flowers. Also potted plants are now bearing lot of green berries. So guys, it's been 65 days since I transplanted saplings. All plants are on maximum fruiting now. And as you can see, Plants are full of red ripe strawberries. Guys, I can literally feel the fresh fruity fragrance of ripe strawberries in my garden. And guys, finally, it's harvesting time. Harvest strawberries only when the fruit turns bright blood red like this. And trust me guys, these fully ripened blood red berries are far more sweeter and tastier than market bought ones. Now I am going to taste one of these strawberries. Amazing and very sweet. This is so juicy, fresh and crunchy. So guys, follow these easy steps to make your own 3D strawberry tower and grow your own organic strawberries at your balcony, garden or terrace. Well guys, that's all for now. Hope you find this video helpful. Please like, share and comment on this video in comment section. Consider subscribing this channel and press the bell icon to get the notifications of new videos. Thanks for watching and keep on gardening.